This is the Baron Collier Memorial. He was born March 23rd, 1873, and he died March 13th, 1939. In the 1920s, Baron Collier owned a million acres of forest in the surrounding region. This spot was a small hardwood forest known as Royal Palm Hammock because of a magnificent stand of native royal palm trees. Collier reserved 150 acres here for what he hoped to have designated Lincoln Lee National Park. Though Collier offered to add enough additional lands for a national park, the federal government did not accept it. It then became a county park and was finally turned over to the state in 1947. All of the tall royal palm trees have been killed by lightning over the years, but second growth trees are slowly replacing them, aided by seedlings produced in the park nursery. This formal memorial was to Baron Collier was established because of his contribution of the area and the land for Collier Seminole State Park. Thank you, Mr. Barron, for having such a wonderful place. And there's plenty of royal palms here, despite what that says. Isn't that right, Crystal? There's a bunch of them out there. Okay, onward to our next landmark.